Hi everyone, today I have a video response for Betty. She is Scrap Passion 01 here on YouTube. Um, June is Betty's birthday month and in fact today, June 20th, is Betty's birthday. Happy birthday, Betty. So for Betty's birthday month on her YouTube channel, one more time, that is Scrap Passion 01 here on YouTube, Betty is having a challenge and she is having a mini shaker embellishment channel challenge i can't even talk today guys i've been listening to kids scream outside all day it's kind of crazy <laughs> we've got one that can shatter glass this little girl is amazing <clears throat> sorry about that okay back to the video okay so betty is having a challenge on her video for her birthday month and mini shaker embellishment challenge. And so I decided I was going to participate and I will link Betty's video down below, down below, so that you guys can see all the rules and, and everything. Now there's still, you know, there's still plenty of time to get your, your entries in if that's what you choose to do. But, um, you know, I'm running a little behind, but I still got it done and, uh, I'm there. So yeah. Okay. Gab, gab, gab. So what I have here today, I used a piece of paper. This is this is the pattern. I am sorry about the lighting, guys. My camera is sitting in not a place that I usually work in, but this is a piece from uh, the paper studio, and it's Keller Kurtz and Company. And I absolutely love this because it is roses and it is pink and it's pretty and I just absolutely love it. So what I did for my shakers, <clears throat> I used bottle caps and <clears throat> I kind of flattened these down just a little bit on my um, Big Shot. And it just squashed them down just enough to give a lip so that everything stuck to it. So this one actually has some pearls in it and there is a pink rose in there and a word piece from Tim Holtz and you know everything is all fully movable. This one says create and I know I'm not doing a real great job because you know what when you've got this acetate you cannot do it without having glare. So there's one and this one says dreams and there's a white rose in this one <clears throat> and this one get over there says believe and there's a yellow rose in that one and i used this little rosebud gimp around the outside edge and uh some wild orchid craft roses and a little pink organdy bow and I know it's kind of hard to tell but they're in there and on the inside of this one I used black cup chain and put that in there this one has some clear rhinestone cup chain and then the other one has some little pink pearls in it so I did those and then I, I had them all ready to go the only thing I hadn't done yet was attach the acetate on the outside and I see Mimi <laughs> I see Mimi's video and she did those as well. So you know what? I had to step up my game a little bit and make a few more. So I did some for 4th of July. Now I know this is June and it's Betty's birthday month, but I decided I was going to do a couple more. So I did these and these ones actually have, um, it's the same B or same sequin in it. And, um, I used, what did I use? I used the five millimeter, they're slightly cupped and it's the frost color from uh, Cartwright Sequins. And then I also used in those some uh, extra fine glitter in the glitz. I used some little micro beads in red. I can't remember what the name of that one actually is. And some tinsel glitter in glitz. This stuff is absolutely amazing because it's it's not small let's see if we can get it to focus are you gonna focus today hello come on but it's amazing how it actually 
you know, sparkles and shines and that sort of thing. And I also used a little bit of the Recollections Extra Fine Glitter in Marine because I absolutely love that color. It's, come on now, pretty. But yeah, so I did all of that and made these snazzy little shakers. Now on the back, they all have a little bit of something that has to do with 4th of July. So there's all of that. Um, I cut these out. I think I've got seven layers of chipboard in between there. And it's the medium weight chipboard in black. And uh, yeah, so get that up there. Take the glare off. Come on, are you in focus? Come on. Okay. All right. My videoing actually sucks lately, guys. There we go. So this little this little star actually has some. I don't. Know, I don't know why we can't see it either. Glossy accents and some of that little glitz, this extra fine glitz glitter on it. But, and I did that to each of them. There we go. And I don't know why we can't see it. It's kind of crazy. Okay, well, I know that when Betty gets these in front of her, she will be able to see that. So hopefully you like these, Betty. So we've got family and laughter remember and cherish believe dreams and create and so hopefully hopefully you like those betty and um i know that miss mimi <laughs> she does some pretty fantastic projects and uh maybe mine will stand up as good as hers do so these were my very very first shakers so hopefully Hopefully, hopefully you like those, Miss Betty. So, okay. Well, there you go, guys. All I need to do now is get a birthday card made, and um, I will get these in the mail before the day is over. So that's it for today. These are my entries and uh, little gifts for Betty for her challenge. So, yeah, I'm out of practice for videos, guys. I just I cannot seem to get my head together on what it is that I'm doing. So, Hopefully these turn out okay, Betty, and i um, going to wrap them really, really well and make sure that they make the trip to your house. So happy birthday, girl. You have a good one, and um, I will chat with you all later. Bye now.